A few men dare to dream. Fewer have the courage to pursue their dream. And one such visionary was Dr. K. C. G. Varghese. He was a man who rose from a humble beginning and whose far-reaching vision, boundless energy and undying enthusiasm catapulted him to the pinnacle of success as one of the top-ranking educationists. His motto was to make every man a success and no man a failure. His legacy lives through the institutions he established and the communities he served. He was born on 20th June 1940 in Kunnam village, Pattanam Titta district, Kerala to Mr. Matai Chako and Mrs. Sosamma. The inspiring journey of Dr. K. C. G. Varghese began in 1965 at Chennai when he took up teaching in automobile engineering. With a natural passion for automobile engineering, his teaching methods made him popular and soon student inflow increased in large numbers. The success of his students in the British Automotive Examination further enhanced Dr. K. C. G. Varghese's popularity. His students assured him more students from Singapore and Malaysia if he would have an institution of his own. And so, in 1966, Dr. K.C.G. Varghese launched Hindustan Engineering Training Center primarily catering to foreign students. Continuing his successful journey, Dr. K.C.G. Varghese married Elizabeth on 20th December 1967. And with her able support, he continued to progress rapidly and HIET's reputation spread phenomenally, attracting students from Sri Lanka, Africa, the Middle East, Singapore and Malaysia. In 1970, HIET moved into its own premises and because of his passion for flying, he commenced the aviation program. The quality of this training program and infrastructure ensured that the program was soon approved by DGCA and by obtaining DGCA approval, he actually pioneered the concept of privatizing professional technical education. His efforts in persuading the then visionary Chief Minister of Tamil Nadu, Sri M. G. Ramachandran, to promote privately held institutions successfully changed the pace of education expansion in Tamil Nadu. Soon after, he established Hindustan College of Engineering in 1985. This was a pioneering effort giving impetus to the field of technical education in Tamil Nadu. The college in 2008 became a university which was the great educationist dream. Hindustan University is now considered one of the finest private universities in the country. Under the dynamic leadership of Dr. K. C. G. Varghese, the group began spreading its wings in the field of education and training. In 1994, Hindustan Institute of Management was launched to offer a variety of management programs. To cater to the arts and science needs, the Hindustan College of Arts and Science was started in 1996 and during the same year, the group launched the Orient Flight School in Pondicherry. The Orient Flight School offers state-of-art flight training to Indian and foreign students. Many of their students have gone on to fly the leading Indian and foreign airlines. In 1998, Hindustan Group started their second engineering college, the KCG College of Technology. Since then, the Hindustan Group of Institutions has developed excellent teaching infrastructure which is on par with international standards and has been producing world-class professionals. Today, the Hindustan group of institutions caters to over 15,000 students. It has an amazing staff strength of 2,000 and a strong alumni diaspora of over 50,000. These are glittering testimonies of his success in the field of education. His penchant for wheels and wings made him adventurous all through his life. His indomitable spirit always rose to the occasion and facilitated him to lead from the front. His personality had all the nuances of a great human being.
He valued friendship and showed great respect, love and concern to his family members and parents in equal measure. He was a true patriot and always advised his students to serve their own country. Being multifaceted, Dr. K. C. G. Verghese was also a good actor, having shared the screen with Malayalam superstar Mamuti in the movie Ayer the Great. His service to the community takes after the short and simple saying of Samuel Butler, You can do very little with faith, but you do nothing without it. He stood up to the needs of the church community and in two years' time networked with like-minded people, raised funds and built the new Martoma Church in Adyar apart from reconstructing the Martoma Church on Harrington Road. In his efforts to serve the society, he leveraged the Wise Men's Organization and contributed to the social and economical development of the community. Under his leadership, the Wise Men International Convention was held in Cochin in 2004. He was also instrumental in developing the Gandhinagar Club to a well-equipped, state-of-the-art facility which is today a prominent landmark in the neighborhood of Adyar in Chennai. With his passion for aviation, he went on to launch India's first private airline, Air Asiatic, in 1990. Dr. K.C.G. Varghese was a, a successful uh, personality in all his activities. He has formed Air Asiatic uh, Company that is the first tint uh, in India. Now there are so many private airlines are there. But Dr. K.C.G. Varghese first thought about this. His autobiography, Wheels and Wings, was released soon after his untimely demise in 2006. Dr. K.C.G. Varghese's list of awards and accolades are in itself a reckon of a simple man who rose to become one of India's visionary educationists. He held on to his dreams and converted them into reality. His relentless hard work drove him to success. He was the pioneer who launched self-financing technical education in the country. He helped the students to explore their own potential. He made them realize that education, hard work and commitment to the nation were what they needed to make themselves employable and overcome poverty. Dr. K.C.G. Varghese's vision to make every man a success and no man a failure is a great inspiration for the next generation as they carry forward his vision for a progressive and prosperous India.